Hello everyone, I'm Comrade Mocha Lover, and thank you for joining me here, of course, in Hearts of Iron 4, playing as a Soviet Union in the final episode of this campaign. It's July 12th, 1944. The invasion of Japan has, so far, succeeded. Now, somehow, I invaded pretty easily. There was no one here. I even invaded this little northern island here, Hokkaido, uh, down here in Tohoku, Tohoku, and let's double check. I want to show you how many ships I've sunk in the past few months. Lost ships... Last month I've lost no ships. Pretty good. Uh, I've sunk almost 400 though, which includes 140 from the last month, which is mostly convoys, cruisers, light hulls. Uh, I've sunk no capital ships, I guess, so far. Yeah, no capital ships. Well, maybe that might have been a heavy cruiser. Oh, uh, it was one of the German ones, but that doesn't really matter at this point. So, uh, yeah, uh, for some reason I haven't found any real big old task forces of the Japanese. We do have. I think a good amount of intel on them. They have 43 to 53 divisions in 1944, which makes sense, I guess, just because, well, they've probably repeatedly tried to invade China. They still hold a little bit of China, but, uh, yeah. Also, Mengukuo is at war with us still, of course, naturally, but they're not really doing anything, which is cool. Navy-wise, they have 218 ships. You know, they have battle cruisers, level 1, battleships, carriers, which honestly are okay. They're not great. Especially if they have, like, level 1 stuff, that's not great. But, uh, yeah, they still have a lot of ships. And I can still naval invade them. Go figure. Anyways, uh, we need to finish this up. Finish this part up. Now, let me double check. So I don't exactly remember. Oh, you're part of Europe. Um, yeah, the British aren't here anymore. I mean, they're, they're still in their isle. I really don't care about them. Uh, Greece was taken out by the Italians. America is, well, getting pretty large in Canada. Which I guess makes sense, actually. Are you guys in the same faction? Are you... No, Canada's not in our faction. Actually, are you fighting the... You are fighting the fascists. Cool. Awesome. Instead, though, right now we're going to be finishing this up. Where are my tanks, though, before we continue? You guys are in Europe. Or, oh, Middle East. Uh, here are my old tanks, which I just converted. Ah, here they are. They're still coming down. They're still making their way downtown. That's cool. Whatever. Uh, you guys, though. You guys could be doing something else, which would be good. You guys are holding the line just in case for funsies. You know, I'm going to go ahead and throw both of you under him. And you were trying to invade this area. So, one, two, three, four, five, six. Send six of you guys right here to go right on ahead. And throw everyone else to Japan as we build up some dockyards here, too. There you go. And throw everyone right here to do the same thing. No more of that. Very good. And where are you? Uh, you shall be right here. Yeah, and do that. Expand immediately. We I don't know how long it, we have until the uh, Japanese, the fascist Japanese under Hirohito will do anything against us, but, you know, we'll see what happens. I'm building a lot of infrastructure, too. Uh, oh. Estonia's gone. I mean, we have Soviet Latvia. We're trying to make a collaboration government in former Estonia, Lithuania, good places. Um, Jap... Okay, Japanese Micronesia, well, eventually we'll see you. Naval invasion, go ahead and do some naval escorts. Uh, you know what, do escorts for now over here too. We have a total of three carriers. Japanese China, no one cares. Another light cruiser, which I made them uh, re go to Vladivostok when they're created. This is kind of large. We have six, four capital ships. We need 16 screens, which we have 17, that's okay. I might consider just waiting here to make more. Just gonna wait for now. We're pushing in pretty darn well. Honestly, I was a little surprised to see how easy it was to invade Japan. I mean, yeah, 43, 50 divisions. That's still not a lot, but that's a lot to defend Japan still. And you know what? We're here. We're cool-ish enough. Uh, I don't even have. I didn't even. Do, oh god, dang it! I didn't even do Japan. <laughs> I thought I did. Whoops. Oh, it, it really doesn't matter at this point. I got my seven subs, the sinking some Japanese convoys, having a good time. What are my casualties like so far? Let's see. Three more of those guys. Mengukuo, well, we already knew that. I'm not joining the war against the British Empire because I have no interest in fighting them right now. We've lost 65,000 to the Greater East Asian Co Prosperity Sphere. Beautiful. Hmm. And I'm trying to finish up a cup of Soviet coffee. So, um, you know what? Instead of going crazy to kill yourselves, just do that. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Sapato. Awesome. I have no idea how to pronounce these names. I'm not Japanese, so sorry. Uh, let's see. 
Very cool. Very cool. Awesome. Actually, you know, we got divisions coming up here. They might end up coming here. Oh boy, what's going on? Oh, oh, we're defending. It looks like we're defending. Yeah, 37% screening efficiency. High screening efficiency defends your capital ships against enemy, enemy torpedoes. Be screened by both your capital and your screen ships. Your carriers, carriers will be screened by your capital ships and screens. Capital ships will only be screened by your screen ships. Well, of course. Uh, let's see. Three capital ships can effectively screen up for two carriers. We're currently screening six ships. Positioning minus a couple percentage. Sword efficiency, fleet speed while retreating. Very good. Yeah. That's why carriers are so powerful. They actually, they feel a little bit... Oh, I lost a convoy, though. They feel just a little bit more powerful than they did in the past. Now, I'm not fighting, you know, a lot of capital ships right now. But they feel just a little bit more strong than what I remembered. Because they were never weak at all. They just weren't as meta as they were before. I knew for a while battleships were pretty strong, pretty recommended. But, uh, oh, nice. Keep sinking those enemy ships. I love it. But, yeah. Hmm. I, I, for some reason, I know a lot of people don't like, like, the naval meta anymore in, you know, Hoi 4. It used to be so simple before man the guns, but for me, I really enjoy making, like, upgrades on ships. Making my ships better, you know. I wish there was a little more customization to the point where if you do one thing, it doesn't really hurt you. Because there's almost, like, a set way of building your ships to a degree. Sort of, kind of. I mean, it depends what you want to do with your light cruisers. I think cru light cruisers are the most... Uh, adaptable ship, I guess I'll say. Adaptable. Yeah, that's a good one to use. Adaptable. Because they could be used for, like, task forces where you can just be anti-subs. You can use them as screens for carriers, other capital ships. Uh, yeah, like battle cruisers, battleships. Destroyers are sort of like that, but they don't have as much strength. So, I don't know. I always find it kind of fun interacting with my ship upgrades. Making our Navy better. Progressing our Navy. Learning more. Doing more becoming better. I don't know. I always thought it was kind of fun. Um, looks like the attacks have kind of slowed down a little bit. That's okay. But not anymore. Go ahead. Uh, we should be able to pierce... Well, that's infantry. Pierce these enemy tanks? Yeah, definitely can. They're weak as butter. Just slice through them. And also, I don't forget, the Sakhalin Islands will be ours once we, we take back all of Japan for our puppet. That, that would be very bueno. Let's see. I am only on limited conscription. And have naval production on, which is very cool. Oh, two ships, two light cruisers, nice. We're gonna wait for another task force if we can make one before the before we kill off the Japanese. Tokyo. Oh, we're fighting over a river. Do we have air superiority over here? Uh, let's see. Ground missions. Eh, maybe a little bit. Just a little bit. Oh, oh boy. Japanese subs trying to attack our convoys. Well, we lost a Filipino convoy. All right. And as you can tell, I made my carrier the pride of the fleet. Very much. Very good. Catholic Mexico has been called in. The pride of the fleet, of course, is Stalin's Iron Pride, a 1936 carrier. You know, it's only 19... It's from 1936. Maybe it's not the best, but it's sunk quite an assortment of fascists. Ah, uh, Stalin's Iron Fist. Design? It's okay. I mean, it's pretty basic, pretty early on. The radar is okay. At least it has radar. The engine could be better... Secondaries could be better, but other than that, it's not that bad. Oh. Uh-oh. Let's see what's going on. Do we have more... Uh, no thank you. What? Wait, what's a flag for uh, Soviet Latvia? Ah, uh, Republic. I love Republics. Hmm, got more political power. Hmm. Ah, Soviet coffee, good stuff. Decisive battle, more capital ship, armor attacks, screen attack defense. Oh, that's so good. Subsidiary carrier rule. I love it. Destroyers, subs, light cruisers. You know what? I don't know why I went with fleet and being. I'm going with carriers. I should have done a base strike. I really should have done base strike, but whatever. Holy crap. 50% more port strikes? Holy cow. That's a lot more. 50% of anything is a lot more, man. Are we not even... Oh. Oh, we went, we went ham. Maybe a little too ham. There you go. Give it a little more of a break. Uh, we're trying to finish up these islands up here. We'll get seven more divisions down here, which would be nice. Actually, the tankies are around here. Well, tankies. Tanks. We don't have tankies yet. I mean, we don't have a collaborationist government in Hungary yet. Wink, wink. Soon enough, though. Oh, Italy. Um, Italy? That's Dutch territory, please. I know you're trying to fight them, but at the same time, please leave them alone. 
Oh, we got a couple. Oh, that's a lot of Italians in the United Kingdom of the Netherlands. Holy cow. That's 19 Italian boy divisions there. Oh. Who can keep. Oh, as you can tell, I've completely ignored this. Yes, there are two communist Chinas here right now. There are literally two. Com oh. Um. You know what? We're doing okay, anyways. I'm not really going to be bothered with that. Lose a few convoys. You know, whatever. Whatever. You might as well help attack. Help support the attack as well. It's only. A, you know, Japanese tank that we can pierce easily. And very good, very good, very good. You guys are coming up north, just in case. You know what? Let's send some coast gods down here. 70. Hurts supply probably just a little bit, but that's okay. There you go. 70 divisions. Ooh, what happened down here? Two Japanese submarinos have been bye bye And we took Tokyo. Great. You know what? I don't even have nukes, but it's only 1944, so I guess... I guess that makes sense. Of course, I took out Korea. Only 7% compliance. Not, not that much. Alright. Uh, let's let you guys stop. Hold. Get more organization. Get some planning bonus going. And then we'll resume our attacks. But I do also want to make sure that... Oh, level 10 out of 10. That's... Already pretty good, not gonna lie. That's pretty good. We come all the way to the bottom. You know what's weird? Yeah, I showed you, but uh, I never go naval production. Never in any of my campaigns have I really ever done naval production. Maybe except for my Polish campaign. Maybe. Other than that, oh, prepare a collaboration government. Yeah, I guess I sent one to these guys. Whatever. Mm, make resistance contacts. Infiltrate the army. Ah, uh, the navy sounds like fun. Defending homeland. There you go. There you go. Oh, prepared. Infl oh. Let's go and do that. Prepare collaborationist government. Civilian administration. Oh, let them do whatever they're doing. Oh, agent captured. God dang it. Captured by the Japanese counterintelligence. Commencement ready. Let's just grab someone here. You are master counterintelligence person. You are a seducer, a commando, a linguist, and an escape artist. Yes, thank you very much. Things are preparing very nicely. Logistics 4, which helps us out quite a bit better. Let's get military police too, even though we don't need it. And look at this cursed number of factories that we have. Ah, perfect. Do we need anything? These more heavy tanks. Other than that, we're doing real well on everything else. Go ahead and repair. I don't think I need... Oh! More subbies. Alright, my carriers. Find those submarinos and blow them up if you can. Even though we can't really find them. Those submarine operations, nice. Let's do some more. I only have seven, but you know what? If I can give a big boost to my seven divisions, great. Oh, wait. Oh, hold on. Hold the phone. Japanese fleet. First Japanese... Oh, God. This is not good. I'm going to lose some ships here. I lost a heavy cruiser. That's okay. Just don't lose the carriers. Okay, the carriers have escaped. Oh, that's not good. The Japanese... Oh, oh okay, okay, then. Okay, okay. You know what? Leave there, everyone. Go home and repair. Repair, repair, repair. We have found the Japanese Navy, and they are scary. Holy cow. Well, I lost a capital ship, but you know what? It's not the worst thing losing an old heavy cruiser capital ship. It could be much worse. Oh, look at that. Can you... You should be able to win. If not... Hmm. That gives... That hurts me when I see that. Help them out there, then. You... Can you not win? Oh, my goodness. Well, they definitely stacked all their divisions here. That's not good. Hmm. Well, once the tanks get in there... We'll see what happens. Because they're not fighting my tanks yet. Yeah, infantry can't do very much. We're going to need more airplanes here. Yeah, that's okay. Fighter shoes. Let's get some 400 more fighters here. We have any other... Ooh, that's pretty far away. That's okay. Can we use some tactical bombers? Yes. And just... You know what? Take out some of the airports, too. They definitely don't like that. Come on, deploy these bad boys. Yeah, this should definitely give us more of an air advantage. 
Are we using tanks in here yet? Yes, we are. They can't pierce us. Our tanks are getting kind of blown out, though. Uh, help them out. Good, good, good. I might have to do another naval invasion behind them, which is fine with me. I don't really care. All right, so you guys hanging out. Cool. I might just invade this little strip. Actually, I'm going to take out that port if I can. So, one, two, three. We're going to invade the port if we can. Go to the same place. Stack yourselves right there. That's why I've made some ports over here. It's an another part of South Korea as well. You guys come down there. If we can take that air base, that would be really helpful. Alright, so so far, it looks like we're probably going to be winning here. What's the air superiority like? We're doing a good amount of damage. We don't have absolute air superiority, and that's okay. Oh, my islands, put you in half. Duplicate, good. Even more planes. Make sure that they have no air superiority, or at least minimal air superiority around here. Very good. Good job, guys. Tanks, you did it again. And these guys are trying to attack again. Oh, my goodness. So we've lost 120,000 against the Japanese. Quarter million for them. That's good. Good stuff. Hmm. There are any more air bases here, though? Plop them up, plop them up. Got plenty of supply around here, or at least we should eventually. Alright, next up, I'm probably going to attack right here. If you lead with the tanks, and you guys support attack, and you guys support attack, what is going to happen? Yuckoff! Infantry expert? Yes, please. You, kill him it. You're good defending, not so much at, at attacking though. Uh, some German, Soviet German divisions. Guatemala is gone. Yes, please. Expand. Did I just research something? Oh, did we win? Oh, we won. Good job, tanks. Still can't pierce us. Good stuff. Still have a few planes around here. That's okay. Kirill? Mm, nothing of interest. He's good to go, though. This is probably a really bad idea, but we're going to do it anyways, because we can very soon. Very soon, and you guys will be doing naval invasion support, even though we have a good number of ships trying to repair right now. Or, mm, that's not bad. oh, three months! Holy cow, for that battleship, at least oh, an entire month. Oh my gosh, Jesus! Convoy sailing, not bad. Get some more destroyer escort efficiency. Oh, we can lower the autonomy of a puppet. Oh, yeah, that sounds like fun. Yeah, let's do that. Why not? All right, tanks. Where are you at? Hmm. Infrastructure is not looking super good right here. If I could just blow through here, that would actually be really good. Can I send you guys to help attack? Because I just cut these five divisions off. Cut these guys. Well, these guys won't be cut off. That's okay. This stuff? Uh, sure. Oh, oh strategic bombers? When was that? Why did I have that? What the heck? Cool. Oh, uh, you know, if I strategic bombers. Oh, wait, you guys are. The heck? Um, yeah, come to Japan. It's the nicest time of year. If I'm making more strategic bombers. And without nukes, what am I even doing? Let's go ahead and bomb their um, airplanes. Their bases. Air bases. That'd be great. Good. Even more damage. Oh, good. We immediately went south. And we started attacking them. Did I go yet? We have not gone yet. This is the only area that we... What the heck? Oh, we need more naval supremacy, but we require 50%. Why? We need more intel, perhaps? No, that's okay. If we can't go, that's okay. Good, we just killed off those divisions. Good. Next up. Right here. Cut all of these guys off. They have no port here, perhaps. Well, maybe they have one right here. Yeah, they have one port right there. That's not bad. That ain't bad whatsoever. Alright, you guys here? Cool. Smash them. You probably don't honestly even need anyone else to help you. Not even infantry. 
but we'll send him as a support group anyways. It's always nice to have a little bit of support in your life. Awesome, great. Now because of that, I'm going to go ahead and send these guys back to Tokyo. Or close to the outskirts of Tokyo to take out that base. Oh look, another tank. Uh, I don't trust you going in the water potentially, so just drive to Asia. And if this happens again, which it won't, come to Vladivostok. There you go. Oh boy, Japanese people. Jap well, Japanese subs, I mean. Oops. Oh, yeah, yeah, duh. You know what? If it happens, it happens. Whatever. Just drive. Gun it. Alright, go ahead and attack. Uh, you four guys can attack there. You guys can attack there. You should be able to push these guys in. And starve all of these soldiers out. Go right ahead when you're done. Oh, we got convoys here. Do not come here. Do not go. This is a no-go zone. It has been quarantined. Please, no, no, no. Oh, Communist China is doing really well against China now. What? Oh, America showed up. Yeah, some American divisions have showed up. Minguko is dying. China is not doing well. And that's okay. That's a good thing. Awesome. Very good. Let's finish this side up. Let you guys go ahead. Oh, do we see something? Ah, small little task force. Four ships. Four screens. Very good. Let time go on. You guys. I actually probably need orders if I want to do this. How much damage? Oh. Let me pause the attack then. How much damage have we done? A little bit to their air bases. Damaged levels. One out of three. Very cool. Very cool. Keep it up. Keep it up. Now from attack from that side. Oh. We can even resist some of our attacks here. No, that definitely isn't cool. Yeah, get the infantry in there too. Smash them. Take the victory points to get no, no more supply. Smash them. Hurry up. Hurry up. Okay, they're defeated here. Gonna get a few more divisions. That's fine. Oh, what is this? Green. Yes! A capper. We've rescued our operative. Very nice. Ah, oh, beautiful. Beautiful. Next up, put it right there and begin more attacks. Counterattack, please, when you are ready. Let the tanks do the same thing. It won't matter. It really won't matter. Cool, so how much longer do we have to wait for our shippies? Oh, they're almost, almost done, except for that one battleship. So you guys are just here. Oh my goodness, you're just... Uh... Go ahead and merge with everyone. Put that on. You just go ahead and repair by yourself. I need everything here first. See, Japan should be looking a little better. Awesome, we're breaking through. These guys have been cut off. That's awesome. And Japan will fall very soon. We've lost half a million? No, only 150,000. Versus 700,000 to the Japanese. Well, we've lost, or we've inflicted 654,000 casualties. Military Police 2, how about Military Police 3? You never know what you might find in Japan, and they're dead. Oh. A lot of lag when that happens. 800,000. Soldiers have perished. Very good. Very good. Now the tanks are up here too. I don't think there's just too much that can hold us back now. You know what? If you can't even invade, just go ahead and do some convoy raiding maybe. If we can do that. Oh, we got four things here. Four screens. You know what? Throw them in there too. Help them out. Get more searching for stuff. Our allies have laid 173 mines. Our enemies have laid one mine. Interesting. Naval supremacy. Enemy supremacy. Look at our number. It's like 3,500, 3,600 versus enemy supremacy between 9,000 to 14,500. Holy cow. That's insane. 41 ships. 53% air superiority, which helps our naval supremacy. Holy cow. Oh, look at those heavy tanks. Say what you will about heavy tanks. They're not the speediest boys, but I prefer 7.1 over the infantry's 4. Do you have anything for us? Oh, he's finally a Panzer expert. In the final episode 
of our campaign on December 20th, Konstantin Orokos Orokosovsky became a Panzer expert. Good for you, man. Good for you. You know what? You're so good. I'll give you force attack. So either attack and win or die. And you guys have done nothing over here because you don't have air naval supremacy. Agent force into hiding, and Japan is done. Very cool. Catholic Mexico. Well, America, America, America. There you are. Um, we're going to turn this a little bit into Führerreich and give Mexico, uh, United States, a good chunk of Mexico. And by a good chunk, I mean all of Mexico because for funsies. Uh, let's see. That was one of my communist Chinas. Ooh, this is due to Japanese People's Republic. You can have all of Japan while I take back the Sakhalin Islands because we trade things very fairly here. There you go, my friends. Uh, you can have these islands too. Japan. There you go, take all states. Very nice. Uh, I, I want to take Korea. Now, which one was our regular? American, Hawaii, Soviet, Latvia... Tahiti Commune? That's kind of cool. I don't think Germany really needs much out of this peace deal. Ah, the Chinese People's Republic. That's one we like more. You can have this. It's going to look disgusting. Just because you're actually my puppet, and except for the other people. There you go. Satellite Japanese Micronesia. Mariana. Uh, I guess I'll take that. Thank you. Estonia? Um, I'll just take that. And Japanese China. Ah, the Dalai Lama. There we go. Now it's looking way more disgusting, but that's pretty much the end of this campaign, my friends. Japan was a little easier than I thought. The common terms looking pretty big. Sure, my allies are trying to fight off the Brits and the Italians, but I'm pretty much done with this campaign. Someday I'll do a world conquest with the Soviet Union again, but uh, today is not that day. But anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed today's episode. If you did, consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below, and I will see you all tomorrow in, hopefully, a different campaign. Thanks for watching, and have a great rest of your day! Alright guys, did you really think I was going to forget this? I might have, but let's go ahead and fix this up real quick. Let's see, Sakhalin Islands, Sakhalin Islands, thank you very much, thank you. Now everything is whole once again. Like I said, have a great rest of your day, guys, and I'll see you all in another campaign.